fish. I was just looking at the trolling motor and I felt him. Gosh dang it, that feels like a channel catfish. Just head shakes and kind of slow. And it, it don't feel like no black bass to me. Yeah, these, these hang around here. These hang around. Trashing. Yep, I, I, I guessed it right. <laughs> he is not the smallest either. He is not the smallest either. And these rocks look pretty sharp to me. This is the Varvazi. I put it on purpose because it has a little bit more body than the trout magnet. When I'm targeting black bass and channel catfish, which I told you I was, I'm just desperate today. I'll take a channel catfish if I can land him. If I can land him. Now my uh, my line is 2.1 pound by rivers. It's not even 0 0.11. It's 0 0.108. But I was smart enough to put a two and a half pound two and a half pound uh, Sunline fluorocarbon leader sniper or something. And that leader, I've never tested it, but I feel it's it's even stronger than two and a half pounds. And um, it's actually not the strength is not that impressive because it's kind of thick. You think, oh, it's better than the rivers. Well, it's fifty percent thicker. Like the rivers is zero ten, and this is zero fifteen. So that's, if you calculate the cross-section, it's actually more than 50%. Probably the cross-section is twice as big. I know catfish will gross many of you. Sometimes it grosses me out too. But look at this beautiful, clean, not a parasite. Look at this beautiful, clean, I need a totally new leader. It's all not just slimy, but it's super rough. Let's see where we got him. Oh, folks! Folks, tell me that this is not a good line. The jig head is inside the mouth. For me, the only way to land these fish is if the jig head grabs them right in the corner of the mouth. So. The teeth are kind of grabbing the jig head, you know what I mean? But the teeth were running on his teeth the whole time. And this sunline... This sunline survived. I'm gonna show you the sunline now. I feel it deserves a show, even though I'm a Varivas guy. Um, hopefully Varivas doesn't get offended. I'm sure Varivas has some really high quality leaders uh, this is FC sniper I've told you this line but look how thick it is 0 15 the other line my main line is 0 10 so there is a reason why it's so strong it's just whoa 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 whoa, whoa, whoa. We're, we're about to hit some very sharp rocks here yeah, the reason is so strong. It's freaking thick. But for leader, uh, I know many people, uh, bass anglers use this for main line. That's too expensive for me. But two feet of leader, that would be enough for any catfish. I'm gonna go retire right now. I put it back in the box here so it doesn't. Uh, get all all right give me 10 minutes and I'll retire and get back to you
fish. That is my funny fish. No, 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 no funny business. You might be funny fish, but but no funny business. I don't want no funny business. He's shaking very funny. This is not a black bass. It's another channel catfish, isn't it? Well, it kind of fits. It kind of fits the day that I'm having. It is, it is bass. It is bass. Extremely energetic, running 100 miles per hour. Oof, small mouth. Small mouth. Come on, give up already, dude. This rod, this rod is just... Just absolutely amazing. It's funny, I caught a smaller one. Then I got this one. This must be a smallmouth spot here. Whoa, 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 whoa. We're gonna hit them sharp rocks again. What to do first? Trolling motor or fish? Feel the fish is ready. Feel the fish is ready. Let me grab him. Because it's been a slow day. I knew that today, if I want to make any kind of video at all, will have to be something, something like buck bass. Okay, let's take care of this fish. He let go of me. I want to say beautiful smallmouth, but I've seen prettier. These are all black. Doesn't even look too young. But you know what? If you had the day that I had today, put on a lot of miles. Went all the way to Percy Priest this morning. Got nothing to show but a few baby bluegill. And uh, yeah, I'll take this little guy. I will take this little guy for sure. And now I'm gonna circle around. Try to catch me one more. Now I'm greedy. There is one more. I knew there's gotta be one more in this brush here. Whoa, 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 whoa. This one's got some meat. This one has got the meat I want. Come on. This one has got the meat I want, folks. Kitek saves the day, I don't know how many times. When you're just struggling to get a bite. There's no pesky... Ooh. Ooh. That is a meaty smallmouth. Meaty. Right now I wish I had some nylon wine. I'm feeling every head shake like I'm tied to the fish with a wire. He gonna explode again. Come on, buddy. You got three good. You got three good jumps. That's about average for a small mouth, and way above average for large mouth. Come on. Come on, man. Come on, man. Come on, come on, come on. You're making me nervous. He hasn't jumped in a while. I know he's collecting. Ashes! 
Man, I said he's making me nervous. He, he's collecting uh, his strength for one more jump. This is a fish. Gosh, if I miss it again. If I miss it again. This one feels even bigger. This one is extremely steady. Let's see if it will... Another small mouth. Exactly the same. Man, this was pushing two pounds. I got two of them and missed both of them. It's just impossible to keep them pinned down with this line with no elasticity. It's just impossible. This point always has something juicy. We've got 10 minutes, just enough to catch one bass here or one crappie. Still heavy, probably just a distant bluegill. Buck bass, what's with the small mouth today? I have good line here, buddy. You ain't going nowhere. I'm gonna yank this guy. I'm so upset with him. I'm gonna yank him out of the water like he's nothing. Come here. The hoist. See if you have four pound line. I know everybody is judging me. If you have four pound line, I know how to yank a fish. Another distant fish. Another distant fish. Don't tell me it's another smallmouth. Is it channel catfish? It's kind of too fast to be channel catfish. Don't tell me I get redemption for the smallmouth with my float. Because this is nylon. This has got the stretch and we have the four pound line and you my friend, you ain't going nowhere. You ain't going nowhere. Oh my god, the irony and the redemption. I call it this part, this point always delivers. The irony and the redemption. Should I bolt flip this fish? Should I bolt flip him? I think the other was bigger, but I count this as redemption. I count this redemption, folks. I count this redemption. Look here. I count this as redemption. <laughs> the stretch really helps and the four pound allows you to put enough pressure so the hook penetrates. You have to understand because the, the mouth is bony. The other hook on the high tech was much bigger. It was size 8. This is size 12. Look here what a jig head. Tiny little gap. But I've got the power to yank and even little gap. If once it penetrates, he ain't going nowhere. Not with this rig. That's not the two pound worry with polyester, buddy. I don't know how many times today I bumped the, the bank, my trolling motor, my transducer.